Hey friends, Comics Crash Course is going to move to an irregular schedule from now on. I will still post videos, it's just... I've got a big new project coming up, and it'll take up a lot of my time. I'm Andre Gilroy, and I'm opening a comic shop. This is the official announcement of Books with Pictures, Eugene, coming to you in 2020. So about a year ago, I was talking to my friend Katie Proctor, who owns Books with Pictures in Portland, Oregon. Hey, Katie. Hi. You know, she said, I've thought about expanding to Eugene. Funny, I said, I've been thinking Eugene needs a shop like Books with Pictures. But we were both really busy, so we put it on the back burner, promising to revisit. Fast forward to this year, I had several big projects wrapping up at once and looked into the future and saw a chance and time. So obviously, if you follow Books with Pictures, you know that they've had their own big year, moving into an amazing new building. We wanted to hold off this official announcement until Books with Pictures PDX finished all of its opening celebrations. But I have been doing research and groundwork with Katie's advice since at least February, and in the past month, we've been filing paperwork, started fundraising, and begun to scout locations. Why start a comic shop? Isn't retail dead? Doesn't everyone read digitally? Well, I can give you a lot of data, like a lot, a lot, about the state of the industry and changes in retail purchasing habits and where and how comics readership is growing. You probably don't actually want that. I mean, if you do, you can call me. But suffice it to say, I promise you that Books with Pictures is a business model that takes into account all of this and more. But more importantly, and at the core of why I decided to partner with Katie and Books with Pictures rather than go solo, is that I really believe in the Books with Pictures philosophy. Books with Pictures is more than just a comic shop. We believe that comics are for everyone. And so we are intentionally inclusive, working to make sure that everyone who comes in feels welcome and safe and can find something to read. No matter the gender, genre, age, interest, sexual identity, race, ability, religion, you name it. We want to be more than a store, but a center for community. We'll hold workshops and classes, drawing nights, and reading groups for all ages and interests. I especially look forward to using the connections I have to the UO Comic Studies program to support Comic Studies students and activities, to do creator signings and events. And because our shop is connected with Portland, hopefully we'll be able to do bigger statewide events too. And that's where you come in. What turns a shop into a community is, well, you. Please feel free to share this video widely. Get people excited, especially folks in the Eugene, Oregon area. In the coming months, we'll be starting to fundraise. It turns out that building a comic shop is not cheap. If you or someone you know is interested in investing in a project like this one, please get in touch. Within the next month or two, when we have a clearer picture of exactly what's needed, we will be launching a crowdfunding campaign. But if financial help isn't up your alley, no worries. There will be plenty of other opportunities to be a part of the team, especially as we get closer to launch. Keep your eyes and ears peeled for updates. I am already awed by the incredible support that I've received, and I really can't wait to get started. See you all very soon.